What's up guys, it's your boy Pete and welcome back to Planting with Pete. Now, if you're new here, this channel consists of almost everything houseplant related. That tickles your fancy, hit that subscribe button, sit back and enjoy the video. Alright guys, with today's video we are tackling these here crazy Hoyas. Now, um, the video of that, the Hoya collection video went out I think maybe last, maybe last week. Um, yeah, and uh, look, let's just be honest. I've done a lot in here, but I have not picked up the camera in about maybe two weeks, I think. But, um, yeah, we're going to tackle this. Today is a nice day. It is fairly hot. I just cut the fan off. I mean, it's not like, I mean, when you hear it in the playback, it's not just, if you're a tickler for noise, I mean, you hear the fountain thing, right? But you may hear the fan i got it on low but it is extremely hot today we're going to have some beautiful weather all week we're talking in the 80s so i'm going to be complaining about the heat yeah it's 80 out there and it's probably going to be 650 in here you know how that goes so yeah um but my plants they love it um but yeah guys i've done something seems a little dark i need to fix some things it's i'm it's giving i know what i can do I'm sorry, you guys. I'm having a moment. I've rearranged so much. You guys haven't seen that. I'm calling it stupid. The stupid shelf. I could never get it together. But guess who got it together? After that, after the video. So you're going to see the video before you even see, see this to even know what I'm talking about. But yeah, it's a mess. That video is well I can talk about it because you're gonna see it for that I cannot get that shelf together it's like my second video doing that I spent trying to get this thing together and I just cannot do it but um, we got it together um, I got rid of some plants as you've seen or you may know you don't know yet oh crap well I got rid of some plants so you're gonna see that after this there you go anyway guys let's go ahead and get started um, some of these Oreos are okay uh, oh and I might end the video depending on see see that that was a gnat um yeah it's that season and then oh my goodness i say that but i always have the uh, it doesn't matter because the gnats can get through the holes i mean they're smart enough they can but some of them do anyway because they're in here right i was doing this so, oh and i might end the video you guys with a a planker planking one of my um philodendrons yeah uh there's two actually there's one that's ready before the other one even though it's really yeah, it is a good time but um, yeah, there's a lot that I'm still doing. I wanted to Hoyas, right? All right, so what I can do um, I have my stand. Oh crap. My table right here in front of me. Um, what we're going to do Where's my hand? Okay, yeah, you should definitely be able to see the Hoyas The Hoyas um, I pro I, It's a lot. I've done a lot you guys um yeah but um nothing really has changed i mean i don't know has it you tell me once you see them but um yeah you just seen these so we're definitely not going to go all go through all of these we're just hitting the ones that need uh, some attention and then also i'm going to rearrange them nothing big nothing major it's just switching the wait where's the camera i mean you know the freak out well no you don't this one he that is crazy how you like I'm pointing in the corner but on camera is like right there anyway um, that is the Chelsea um, instead of them facing the ring facing you we're gonna that way <laughs> Don't want, yeah um, let's grab her because there's a plant right there that you can't see um, I mean I can show you it's not a big deal but well please don't break I'm talking about the Hoya, not the other plant, but there's, um, you, can you see the leaf? Yeah, if you can see the leaf, then you know what plant that is. Um, but yeah, here's the Chelsea, as you can see, um, yeah, she's pushed off of her finger my bobber my jigger. Let's hope that's not too bright for you guys. And what we're just going to do is bring her back down. Um, we have this one here, the one where you can't see the the smaller one you guys but she's finally pushing off a vine so let's grab her let's keep that there and you know what let's go under 
if you can catch these Hoyas before the vine like starts to wood and all, you can, there we go, maneuver them so that, she is gorgeous, so that um, you can get them on your trellis or whatever you're trying to do with them. Let's grab the next one. Yeah, this should be, oh, she's actually pretty good. I mean, yeah, not even gonna lie. I love this little guy. <laughs> oh, God. This is gorgeous. Like, freaking gorgeous. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, we're aiming for these future leaves there, but... Yeah, let's see. Let me turn this light up. Oh! I have the door open, so if you hear any outside noises, that will make a lot of sense, you know? Um, but here we go, yeah. Turn my ring light up. Gorgeous girl. Nothing wrong with it. She hasn't really grown in, in um, length-wise, but she's been filling in the gaps like all, well not all of these, but most of her leaves had one leaf on them, but she's been filling them in, um, and that one there is coming in. Guys, this is not a, a, well it is a Hoya video, so I can't say it's not a Hoya video. Um, let's get the ones that, oh, need the attention on, like this Hoya. Villa Tenoides right here, which is again another gorgeous special mod. Um, yeah. Now she's is a. I noticed she don't have clamps, and I'm pretty sure. Also noticing that the <clears throat> the vines are a lot more curlier. Okay, which way are we going to go? Are we going to go this way? Yeah, we're going to do it, guys. We're doing it. Alright. Yes. Please don't break the leaf. It has little hairs in it. Oh, wait. I need to get... There we go. There we go. This is why this is easy. Okay. That one. Fairly easy. Um, give the leaves enough time to adjust. And as you can see, I didn't harm the leaf. I'm sweating. Guys, I haven't sweat oh, out here in so long. It is just, it's strange. All right, so I really can't do much to this one. I think I told you guys in the update, I knocked the growth <laughs> off of there. Um, and then there's another one coming in on that note there. So I really don't want to touch it. Um, yeah, I really don't want to touch it. Uh, my sabah is sabahing. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's grab. Well, I can't do much to the microfiber. Yeah. I mean, it's fine. The other uh, let the. Sheesh, guys. All right, guys. The last plant over here in the corner. All right, guys. Trying to watch out for any new leaves, new growth. Um, doing a quick break for you guys, it was like a snippet, um, yeah, I broke off, um, I think two new leaves, and if that, not begonia, if that, um, Hoya had any crap, yeah, that Hoya, if she had any new growth again, I would have messed it up because I completely, you know, you guys, this is her. I noticed this not that long ago, but um, I didn't know that she was this um, wild. So let's see, can we get her? Let's bring you down, guys, so you can see what I'm doing. I'm trying to figure this here out. There's new growth points everywhere. And again, OG. And I'm not sure which way to, I guess I have to go this way. Um, and what's correct, I knew I had some clamps. Well, let's see, can we wrap her before I try and clamp her? And to be honest with you, I can't. Guys, did I already mention it is hot? It is hot. It doesn't look too healthy. Let me show you guys. I found a dongle. I found a dongle. The other dongle halted. She has new growth coming from her. This is not what this is. Oh, crap, guys. But you know I love to talk. But where is it? Is that a donkle? Can someone see that? 
Is that Donkey Pie? Does anybody know? It looks like it. You see it? It looks Donkey because I see two leaves and then I see something else. But why is it juicing? Did I damage it? Oh my goodness. Did I kill it? What did I do? I don't know. I did something. Let's put it up. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, yeah. Let's get it back. Let's get it back. Hopefully the light. Oh my god. Let's get it back. Alright guys. The next one um, is the Crinkle 8. But I mean there's... Yeah, you can see she's sticking out. But there's not much I can do beside... Can you kind of see that? Let's get her out. Okay, guys. Um, no donkles. I see some. I cut that. I see some broken growth. I see new foliage. Um, yeah, I just wanted to do the same thing, you guys. Nothing special. I love how these leaves feel. Oh, yeah. I'm not surely knocking area roots off. Can you guys see me? I'm starting to sweat. You see that? Okay. But, um, yeah, I don't see any peduncles. Let's lock that in there. All right. Let's get her back. All right, guys. The microfiber is fine. Um, I do see new baby leaves, so I'm not going to too much pressure her on that one. Um, this here, clearing sorium. Um, she is starting to vine. I see little leaves on each in every uh, node point so what we're going to do um, while she's still very flexible guys yeah, these are nothing but wire metal hangers nothing special again I'm thinking about doing the longer oval um, wire thingies um, what is this thing I guess it'll be a trellis wire trellis yeah, does that work? Yeah. Alright, let's get the rock back in. Oh, there's leaves all up and down this thing, you guys. If I can wrap this right away from each leaf. Oh, my goodness. Oh, this thing is one, two, four, six, eight new leaves on here, you guys. You definitely probably won't be able to see them. Wait, kind of, sort of. Anyway, they're there. Um... So I'm going to put her back. Um, we're going to end this here video with a quick um, planking of my Oreo or Golden by pen. Um, you guys remember we did separate her and she is definitely ready. And I mean definitely ready a long time ago for a plank. Alright guys, we made it back. I got my plank. Um, got my substrate. Let's move my phone. Let's go ahead and get started. Um, it's very cloudy. I checked the weather. Um, it's still gonna be hot, but it's supposed to be cloudy. There's like 17% chance of rain. So, I mean, there's that. Um, I have a pot here with my wicking core in it, and then there's coarse soil. All right. Hopefully, you guys can see what is going on. Yeah, let's go. All right. So let's get this back and the moss back off with so what we're going to do is get these girls they've been growing in the way that I, I want them to grow which is um, clearing off a backside I'm um, basically you guys growing one way so I can place these up here on the plank and it looks like I may have to take the leaf off let's see can we get this out come on yep got it out all right got my tape <sighs> Um, a lot of this here bottom foliage I'm just going to remove all right guys so now that I got her where I would like her to be I'm gonna get this here tape um, and this process is a lot easier than the rest because um, she has tiny area roots so there's not much I can do at this point aside from waiting until she decides she wants to latch on you know I might have to take another leaf off, which will free up a lot of space. Let's do that. Alright, leaf gone. 
And there we go. Yeah, I know. It doesn't look like much, huh? But we're gonna give it time and gonna give her some time. All right, so let's go and get her pot situated. And what I don't have in here is my poem. I don't have my poem. All right, which is okay. Okay. All right, we're gonna push this far back. And then, <clears throat> very simple, you guys. Back fill it. Um, the only thing that I would have to do, which I'm pretty sure I might just do off of camera so I don't have to stop the video, is just put um, some pond in the back so that, you know, she doesn't do that. And we don't need that, like, at all. So, yeah, I'm going to fill this here up. Now, I could have gave her a bigger steak. Uh, uh, you know, we'll talk about that later. But as of now, um, this is what we're going to do. I do know I need to go get some more steaks, you guys. I have maybe one more. No, there's not a maybe. There's one more that needs a plank that I wasn't going to plank, I was just going to let her be a hanging situation, you know? But now, oh, and then also, you guys, make sure, well, I'm tucking um, the sphagnum moss up towards the bottom half of the plank. Uh, let's put this sphagnum moss in there. And that is it, guys, here for today's video. Um, like I said before, as you can see, she's a mess right now. Um, <clears throat> I just put three back there. It's good enough to hold it. Okay, never mind. All right, guys, that is it here for today's video. Please do me a favor, hit that like button. Also, comment down below. Make sure you are subscribed, you guys. Um, and hit that notification bell. This bell will keep you notified and let you know what's going on over here at Plant with Pete. And that is it, guys. Um, if you like to donate on the, if you like to donate directly to the channel, there's a little heart thingy with a little cash tag thing. Follow the instructions. Um. I think that is it. I don't think that is it. Yep, that is it. Um, I'm going to try to maybe get maybe two more videos done and do some more lighting. And there's a lot to do, guys. But I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.